filming now, so you guys are going to have to lift your game a little bit. I'm not saying not saying that you haven't been really good, but you know, we're not, we're not at home in our lounge, all right? So anyway, so I look. As Paul said, we're doing an MIC, uh, Melbourne Comedy Festival show, and during that time, I, I turned 50, right? And so I've had to reflect a bit. You know, when you turn 50, a milestone. I've reflected on life, right? And, and I've come to the conclusion, life's just like, it's like a string of letdowns followed by the occasional disappointment, right? <laughs> no, like, I'm not saying all life's bad. Like, when you, like, you guys, how old are you, mate? In your 20s? Yeah, see, that's perfect. That's like when you're at your, you know, your funeral and you've got all, everything and all your hopes and all that, same as those guys up the back. Like that guy up the back, he's just, looks like he's just lying there and he's thinking, oh, fuck, I can't wait to go home and I can just lie on the couch and crack an erection for three hours <laughs> <laughs> just because I can, you know? I fucking can too, mate. It's called Viagra. <laughs> Gives you a headache, but you know, it's still there. But that's the thing, you can do it without a headache. And, all right, and, and then, but the thing is, like, you're at the top of it, you're at the top of a mountain, right? You think you're at the top of a mountain, but you're not, you're at a, it's a cliff, right? Because pretty, pretty soon, you're going to be 30, and then it just goes, <laughs> right? And then one day, you just wake up and you're looking at the ceiling and you're 49 years old and you realise the only thing that you've got to look forward to in life is that once, maybe twice a week, you get to go to a small little bar on the other side of town from where you live and you get to tell jokes to strangers. <laughs> well, that's the highlight. But, but then it gets worse, right? Because because then life throws you out this other carrot, right? And it, it, in my case, it's like the Melbourne Comedy Festival. And, and it's like, here's your chance, Pete. Here's your chance to turn your sorry life around and fucking, you know, make a show, right? So I'm making a show with Paul. And, and in my bit of the show, right, I've been thinking about this a lot for months, like day and night, right? And I thought, so what I was going to do... I wanted a big opening to the show, right? So I'm gonna I'm gonna dress up as as Elvis, right? And then, but I'm not coming on to an Elvis song. I'm coming on to Neil Diamond's Hot August Nights, right? You you'd know that, wouldn't you? Right? Anyone born in the '60s, right? It's a big opening, right? <laughs> uh, okay. So I'm coming on to that, and it's gonna be like a WWE opening, you know, like. You know, like The Rock. It'd be like something that The Rock would come onto, right? So, I've been planning it all, and, and I ordered the suit, the Elvis suit, right? And today it arrived. So I'm going to show you the suit, and I'm going to put it on. And you tell me how... Can I, can I have an assistant? Can you come and, Can you just... While well, I put this on... Alright, so just wait for that bit, right? Yeah, you do that bit. Oh, no, I won't take off your clothes. Oh, you don't have to see that. <laughs> right? So, there's, there's the pants. Right? Right, that's the pants. Here we go on the arms. Right? Can you see it? Are you living it? Yeah, right. That's the cape. Right. That's, that's, that's the cape, right? Now I bought this. I bought. Oh, there's the belt. We need the belt. Right. Put the belt on. And so this is a bit like the World Wrestling Federation. Right, with the belt. Right. And so I, like you, you can imagine my disappointment, right, when I opened this and got this. But then there's more. Right. <laughs> Because this is the wig they gave me. <laughs> right. <laughs> Don't nothing but a hand on. So, so this like <laughs> this has come from a, a company called Smithies, right? It's like that's not Smithy with a th, it's with a double f, like. 
for fuck's sake, what the fuck is that? <laughs> <laughs> and um, yeah, so, that, so that, that's it. So if you want to see how this train wreck turns into a show, come to mine and Paul's show <laughs> at, at the Elwood uh, Lounge for the Comedy Festival. Thanks a lot. Did you get that? <laughs> <laughs>